The shambles are real because this is the second time I recorded this video. Third, kind of. I need to do a few takes. <clears throat> since I only got four screenshots since the last time I checked of if I should do a glasses evolution spam, I decided to do a YouTube video also since it's kind of hard to like hold the phone and put glasses on because I want to try them on too. Um, I would like to do that in a video. This won't be edited, so you'll hear a lot of um. And the last time I did this video, I did not look at the camera at all. So I looked like I was talking to somebody in front of me instead of looking at the camera. Hopefully I am looking at the camera. You know what, I'm gonna check if I even look at the camera. All right, I was, good talk. Um, yeah, so here I am. You'll hear a lot of Joshua screaming probably. Joselito also interrupted my other one. Watch my mother just randomly walk in. Also, because I'm filming in front of the front door. High quality stuff, guys. High quality stuff for my two viewers. So let's start from the beginning. Seven or eight years old, second grade, I got glasses because I used to watch TV like this. And I think people tried to stop me, but I didn't listen. They didn't like weren't persistent enough in stopping me. Therefore, I went blind at an early age. Not completely blind. Almost there. So here they are. Pretty iconic if you ask me. I quite like them. I feel like a 90s kid. Hi! <laughs> ah! Yes, of course. I was interrupted again. That's fine. Anyways, seven years old, second grade, blind. Bada bing, bada boom. They're great. They're red, like a deep purple red on the outside and like a hot pink on the inside, kind of. Okay, so. My next pair is the pair that I don't have. My favorite pair. They were purple on the outside, orange on the inside. Really great. Probably don't have any pictures with them. They reminded me of an octopus in a cool way. I don't know. I thought it was really iconic. Um, I think the next pair is these guys. They're purple on the outside. And this is when I started hating those dudes. Because I do not have enough of a nose structure to hold the thingies without it bothering me. And it really bothered me. So I got another pair like the same way and these are actually broken, but I call these like the cherry blossom pair. I think these were entering middle school that I got these guys, maybe. And you could probably see a trend here of the kinds of glasses I thought I looked good in. There. And from there, I think was I think these were eighth grade because a lot of people remember these glasses and they didn't want me to switch glasses after this. They're like stripes on the side. And yeah, this is where the Illuminati nose also started because my nose looks especially like triangular here because it doesn't really help with my face. But I like these because they were round on the bottom and a little nerdy looking. The problem is I thought like nerdy was the thing that looked good on me, not round. Because big glasses were such a big deal. Like big, before, you know, there was like Coke bottle glasses way back when. And obviously 90s super thin cool guy glasses. And then the bridge. Anyways, but when I was like entering high school, I think I was entering high school, big glasses were the thing. Like eighth grade slash freshman year. So I got these guys. And they're pretty big. But I still have the big Illuminati nose. They're just like light purple on the inside and like a growth grandma brown on the outside and i didn't realize this until <laughs> my first take but i have the same pair like i thought it was so cool getting like green on the inside and brown on the outside but comparing them they're like exactly the same like the color on the inside is honestly the only difference the green kind of throws you off but i feel like it's the exact same frame and whatnot so i have the same illuminati nose this table there we go um and also for my first sake i forgot to grab my for uh Reese current pair of glasses so this is my current pair i quite like them i'm quite looking like quite like looking like harry potter um they're nice and rounded and the super high bridge helps with my nose problem like it's still kind of Illuminati looking, but like tasteful Illuminati. And if you see me looking like that, it's because I have my contacts on this 
quite painful for me right now. The side is like that. It's like a cool, cool gal. Oh, and I like the little dots because it makes me think there's like a camera inside. My FBI agent really, really likes what I do. Um, and I'm wearing contacts right now. I did get contacts at like 16, 17, and I wore them like every day. I got like the six months and then those were down and I got another six months, but I got lazy with wearing them. And now I'm not lazy because I'm tired of like having frames on my glasses. Like not, okay, it gives me vision, but it obstructs my vision in a way because I can't see like in my peripheral. With contacts, your eyes obviously move with the contacts. Yeah, um, and I also want to appreciate my face a little more with less clunkiness around it. Hopefully one day I can wake up and just see. I don't know if I'll ever get the surgery. I'm a chicken. Mock. Mock. Ever since the Final Destination video, you're better off not watching it because I'm certainly traumatized. So yeah, glasses evolution. Lots of shambles. I was only able to record this because there's so many shambles today that gives me energy to do this. I can't even nap. <laughs> it's a Sunday afternoon and I'm not napping, but it's okay. <clears throat> That's that. Thanks to the two people watching. I was thinking about um, doing like a trailer compilation thing and like uploading that, but nah. Most of my first few trailers are really trash. So, no thanks. Uh, if you're one of the two people watching and you want to recommend me something to post, let me know. Because I'm definitely procrastinating. I have so much work to do. I'm definitely procrastinating by making this video. Not properly editing it, but making it. So, yeah. Good talk.